There is always a need to feed families who are food insecure here in Middle Tennessee. Yeah, it's why the news to Food to Families School Food Drive has been helping stock the shelves of Second Harvest Food Bank of Middle Tennessee and other local pantries for more than 40 years. Oh yeah, Sylvia Castaneda catches up with one of our community partners to share what we all can do to help. It's Neighbors Helping Neighbors to provide food to families facing hunger in our community. And what's so incredible about this annual school food drive is that students, their families, and school staff are behind the generous donations being collected now through October 31st. News 2 has such great partners helping us again this year, like David Briggs with Fifth Third Bank. He's the regional president for Tennessee. So happy that you're back. Talk to our viewers about why it's so important to support this project. Sylvia, hunger still exists in our community as families continue to struggle make ends meet. We're currently seeing one in six Middle Tennessee children facing food insecurity. Hunger affects a child's health. It impacts their schoolwork and even their self-esteem. Students and their families shouldn't have to worry about where their next meal is coming from. This is why the News 2 Food to Family School Food Drive is so important this year. Students and school staff are helping stock the shelves of Second Harvest Food Bank and local pantries. That way, families are able to get the food they need to thrive. You are so right. So Fifth Third is also helping in several ways this year. Can you tell us about that? That's right. At Fifth Third, we're committed to creating a greater impact for our community. One way is by volunteering at Second Harvest. We know that every box of food we pack and every hour Fifth Third employees give to Second Harvest makes a difference in the lives of children and their families who are food insecure. We also make our own financial contribution to help Second Harvest. Plus, we're supporting the students who are making a difference during this very important food drive. Fifth Third, once again, is providing the prize money to be awarded to the top schools as a thank you for the students' hard work in stocking Second Harvest and local pantries. And we so greatly appreciate that as well. So then how can our viewers help? I know you always have some great ideas to share with our viewers. Sylvia, people can donate their time hosting their own food drive. The most needed items are like the ones we have here. Peanut butter, pasta, beans, canned goods, and cereal. People can donate their time by volunteering or they can donate directly to Second Harvest. That's because every dollar donated to Second Harvest provides four meals to families in need. That's such an easy way to help. It is, and I love the way that you and Fifth Third help. Talk to me about from the heart. I know that you're one of those guys that really feels it when you volunteer. Why is it so important to you? Sylvia, first and foremost, we see the data, and it's still shocking to me of how many in our community struggle with food insecurity. So number one is serving a, a very valid purpose. Number two, when you walk into Second Harvest and see how large it is in the amount of food, it's another reminder of how fortunate we are and how much we need to help those that are struggling in our community. And lastly, it really is fabulous team building. You're there to serve a common goal, a common good purpose, and you're spending great hours with your teammates helping a great cause. But we appreciate you spending so many hours with us promoting this, helping to inspire people to get involved just like Fifth Third Bank does. David, thank you for sharing all this information. I know people are going to get ready to go shop. I think you and I need to go shop. Let's go. So we're going to send it back to you. All right, thank you. Visit WKRN.com slash food to families to register your school for the food drive. The food drive runs through October 31st. Or you can always visit secondharvestmidtn.org to make a donation, set up your own food drive, or to volunteer. All are great ways to help feed those in need in our community. More Local on 2 right after this.